Okay, so I'm going to do some Cambly calls today. Ooh, I almost missed my priority hour because when you sign up for a priority hour, if you are like more than 10 minutes late, like they'll let you be a little late. But if you're more than like 10 minutes late, I think it's like 10, yeah, about 10 minutes, then they'll release you from priority hour. So you wouldn't be doing priority hour anymore, but you can still log on. It's just during priority hours when they just automatically push calls to you. <laughs> they just, anytime, you know, trials, you get a lot of trial calls. Cause you know, when people are trying out the app for the first time, many of them, they don't know what tutor to request. So they just log in. They just log in to speak to anybody. And that's what you're going to get. Anybody. <laughs> you're going to get that anybody. And that's what they just log in. So if you aren't logged in, ready to go, and you had signed up for priority hours, then they just release you from it. Now, if it happens a few times, it's fine. But if it keep happening and you just keep missing priority hours, then they tell you, okay, you can't sign up for priority hours for like three days or so. So many days, they won't let you do it. So you know how Facebook has like Facebook jail. If you're a Facebooker, Cambly has like a Cambly jail where they say, okay, you can log in. You could take calls. You could still take calls and make money, but we're not going to reserve this hour for you where we're just giving you all these trials because you're not on <laughs> like you said you're going to be on so i almost missed it but i'm on now it took me a while because i realized at the very last minute that i wanted some coffee <laughs> so my little rush to go make me some coffee almost costed me so you have to do your verification your verification just consists of a camera check and they run through to make sure your connection is smooth so you just click and it does all the work it'll check make sure your camera can detect you and that your network is okay for you to take calls so I'm about to become visible let's see what calls I get Sometimes it's slow and you don't get back-to-back -back calls. Today, I actually have some reservations, but right now, it's a little after nine. My first reservation doesn't start until 10. I have three reservations today. I love it when they reserve time, like they set aside time. So I have a reservation at 10 from 10 to 10.30. Then I have one at 10.45 to 11.15. And then one from 11.45 till noon. So then the times in between there, you know, I'm just going to get people, just random people. But I love it when I have reserve time because I know who I'm talking to. And it gives me an idea of, you know, especially if they have a lesson that they want us to go through. And lately, my reservations have been with people that I have never met before. I've never had a class with them. So I guess they just found me in the list of tutors and decided, you know what? I'm going to reserve some time with this person because they probably liked my profile. And so they wanted to reserve time, which is wonderful. Mm -mm -mm. The higher your rating, the higher up on the list that you are for people to request you. Now, it looks kind of slow right now. Let me go. You can always switch over from, I'll show you. Hold on. Okay. Here we go. So you see here, I'm on the tutor profile. Now where your picture is in the corner, you can always go down to where it says student. 
And then if you go down to where it says student over there, then it'll allow you to switch over to what the students see. So you're on your student profile. And see, you see I'm right at the top. The higher your rating, then you're higher up on the list for people to select. So it looks like it's pretty slow because there's only one other person in front of me. And so you see the list here of people. It looks like nobody's busy. These are all, okay, there's some at the bottom. So there are only a few teachers that are busy. When you see the red, that means they're busy. And all these teachers up here in the green, they're all available to, all these tutors are available to take calls. So I'm going to switch back because... With me being over here, then it's having me offline. <laughs> I wouldn't take calls. Ah, it wouldn't let me switch back. Okay, I'm just going to go back this way. There we go. So you just click this right here, and you're able to switch back. So now I'm in my tutor profile. So it shows that I'm available again. But, yeah, if you ever wanted to see, like, I wonder how many people are online right now. You can switch. Go to your little picture in the right-hand corner and click that little carrot, that little down carrot arrow. I think they call it a carrot, that little down arrow. And then go down to student. Go to your student profile, and you can look at all the tutors that are online. There's a bunch of tutors online right now. Yesterday was payday. You get paid every Monday. So I got money in the bank. Money in the bank. And then so Tuesday, everybody's getting hitting it hard. Well, Monday evening and then Tuesday and on because you get paid uh, 11 a.m. Eastern time. Is when, It's either Eastern or Pacific. For me, it's noon. I'm Central Standard Time. So noon is when the pay cuts off. And then whatever you've made up until that point, that's what goes into your account, your PayPal account. So anytime after that, will be paid the next Monday. And so I worked until 1 p.m. yesterday, and then that's it. And so today I'm going to try to put in... I was off from Dada today, but I did, I did do some part-time hours. And then I took a nap because I was tired. <laughs> and now I'm back on with Cambly. And I'm going to try to put in maybe five hours today. I'm going to see if I could crank, if I could crank out six hours or more, if I can crank out, oh my gosh, if I can crank out like eight hours today, not all at once, I'm not doing that, but like, you know, in my spare time, just eight hours, then I would be so happy. Most of the time I would just have YouTube going in the background or I'll watch something because my TV's over here. You see that? Yeah, it's my living room. I'm in the dining room area. See, look, I'm at the dining room table. So my TV's over there, and then I'll just have my remote, and I'll watch, sometimes I'll watch a movie, and then when a call comes in, I just pause it, mute the TV, whatever I need to do, and then take the call, and then after the call, then go back. So I don't have to just sit here. Like some people are like, I'm not wasting my time and sitting here. You don't have to sit here. So right now it's, it's kind of slow. Sometimes it's back to back to back to back to back, but it's kind of slow today because there's so many people online and it depends on what time of day you get on. It really depends. So at this time of day, it's nine, a little after 9 a.m. for me. So at this time of day it must be a popular time because there's a lot of tutors on. But that's okay because I can just do other things. I'm about to go in there and make me some coffee. What I will do most of the time, I unhook my headset. I'll just keep it on my head, but unhook it from the computer so that when I hear a ring, I can hear it while I'm in the kitchen. I might go and fix me a, a little breakfast or something and get my coffee and then just come back over here and sit, and just watch YouTube or TV or something. And then when a call comes in, then I'm just like, hello, <laughs> and I'm ready to go. So while I'm waiting, I wanted to address some frequently asked 
questions. A lot of people have been messaging me saying that they heard that you're not paid for the trials that you get because they have five minute trials, 15, I think even 10 minute trials. You are paid. The customer, the student is not paying, but you are paid for every minute that you tutor. You're not just on here tutoring for free because to start off, especially before you get a reputation, it's quite possible that your first week or so would be 80% trials, you know, or you might get people that aren't trials, but they didn't specify a tutor or they just, you know, they like to, there's people that's been on Cambly for a long time and they just love meeting new people. They just love just clicking on new tutors. And so, but a lot of it will be trials to start off. You're paid for every minute that you are tutoring. Now, say you were on for like 45 seconds, you know, close to a minute. They're going to round it to a minute. As long as it was more than, I think as as long as it was like 45 seconds or more, (laughs) it's going to round to that one minute mark. They're not going to be petty and be like, oh, that was 52 seconds. That wasn't a minute. But they will round it to that one minute. So you get your 17 cents. It's 17 cents per minute minute and no you don't have to wait until it adds up to an hour for you to be paid you know ten dollars and twenty cents an hour it's per minute so if you talk for one one hour and four minutes you're going to be paid for one hour and four minutes if you only had a conversation for 50 minutes and you're 10 minutes short of an hour then it's going to calculate your pay for 50 minutes so it's not to wear up you didn't reach an hour so you get nothing it's not like that as long as you have accumulated at least twenty dollars then you will get a deposit put into your paypal account that's the only rule it just has to be at least twenty dollars for you to actually see a payday if you were on you know did tutoring all week and you just like you know, got cold feet or whatever, and you didn't quite reach $20, then you won't get paid that Monday. But it's going to still stay in your Cambly account. It's going to stay there. It's not going to be forfeited. You're still going to see it. But until it adds up to at least $20, then it won't be released to you. So that's just, you know, that's rule of thumb. I believe Palfish is the same way. You know, all the work you do, it has to add up to at least $20 for them to make a deposit for you into your account. So now that that has been clarified. Now, another question that I have seen was, well, what if I opened up a reservation slot, someone reserved time for me, but I'm actually on a different call during their reserved time. That's okay. So what, I do say I had someone reserved I have a 10 o'clock appointment right so say someone else calls me and our conversation is running over the 10 o'clock mark at the beginning of class if I see that they had like a 30 minute 30 minutes worth and they called me and it says 30 minutes and I know we only have 20 minutes until my next reservation then I tell them you know I want to let you know that at, you know, in 20 minutes, I have another call that I'm scheduled for, but we can still talk for 20 minutes if that's okay. Most of the time, if it's, you know, if they're going to get at least 20 minutes with you and they chose you, then oh, okay, that's okay. They'll either save their 10 minutes or they'll just, you know, check out somebody else for their last 10 minutes or so. And so I've met a lot of new people that wanted to reserve me that way. So I guess they wanted to, you know, kind of see what my tutoring is like. And we only had a portion of the time that they wanted to spend during that session because I had a schedule coming up and they were fine with it. You'll get some that they would rather speak to a tutor for the whole session and they'll let you go. they would be like, oh, OK, OK, well, bye, teacher, you know, OK, thank you out. Okay, have a nice day. I'll talk to you later. They'll let you go. And that's fine too. You won't get penalized because you didn't stay on the call. Give them the option to either stay on the call with you 
until your reservation comes in or for them to let you go. Give them the option. They're not going to get upset because you said that you're going to talk to someone else. You unfaithful tutor you. (laughs) So that's okay. It's okay. No problem at all. And so, yeah, some, someone had asked me, is it always back to back? Well, it looks like I was released from my priority hour because it took me too long to get verified. I think it took me 13 minutes instead of the 10. And so I'm not on priority hour right now. So if you're not on priority hour and you don't have a reservation, then you just have to sit. You have to sit with the rest of the tutors and wait. And that's fine because especially since I'm at the top of the list, when people call in and they don't, if they don't have a a tutor that they normally speak with and they see me at the top, then they're just going, oh yeah, there she goes. A lot of them don't go that far down, you know, in the list. Some of them go off of, you know, your presentation, your, your profile picture. Some of them actually go and read your profile. They call it your CV. You know, when you do your resume, they call it your online resume, your CV. And so I've had people say, so I read your CV and I see that you're a teacher. What, what grades do you teach? You write books. What type of books do you write? Yeah, you guys, I write children's books. So you can check out my website, um, www.misslala, M-S-L-A-L-A books, B-O-O-K-S dot com, (laughs) misslalabooks.com. And so, yeah, I just published my, you guys have probably seen me talk about it. This is my most recent baby. It's my ABC book. It's an ABC movement book. And I incorporated real photographs for children to be able to really relate to. And so I'm excited about that. So they asked me about it because they read my CV. Some of them just picked the first, you know, in the first options available. So you'll have people choose you for different reasons of choosing you. (laughs) So I'm about to look. I'm about to unplug this headset and I think I'm about to boil me a couple of eggs. I love eggs. Boil me some eggs and make me some toast while I wait. And I'm just going to sit here visible and see if somebody rings in. So I shall be back with another video, more information and some more teaching vlogs so that you guys can see me just teaching live uncut in living color the only editing you'll see on here is probably words at the bottom (laughs) but I won't chop and splice and all that good stuff so you can actually see what it's like but if it gets too too long then I might just speed it up a little bit so until next time TTF time for some eggs baby in